Omaha 2, CC 2. Tigers with coffee left circle, wrist shot, glove save, Lad Cozy. He is one of the best goalies in all of college hockey. When shouldered away by Lad Cozy. Last month, Simon Lat Cozy was named the National Goalie of the Month and the Goalie of the Month for the conference. That's a big deal. It doesn't happen all the time with, you know, with any program. But what, what did that mean to you? I look back at it, and there is only six months of NCAA season, and uh, being one of maybe 60 goalies uh, in six months that can achieve it, usually it's only one of six. So uh, that's a pretty big deal. But I wouldn't be able to uh, achieve it without my, without my team and my teammates. That's the humble approach he takes every day at practice and on game days. His coach has seen the work ethic from the very first skate of the offseason. Very similar attitude all season long, uh, which I think speaks to his uh, mental toughness. And uh, he's just stuck with it, and, and now you're seeing him get rewarded with playing some great hockey. That great hockey has opened up the eyes of NHL executives. Shot, glove save, Lad Cozy. He's not eligible for the draft, but he can sign as a free agent. I know it's all about UNO hockey now, but in the future, for that dream to come true, that's still right there for you, right? Yeah, I think that's uh, maybe even an advantage for me that uh, I, like 32 teams, one of 32 teams can pick me and not just one as if I would have drafted. Right. So uh, it's all about them. I cannot affect their decision. I can do just my job and get better every day. The work ethic comes from his upbringing in Slovakia. 89 of his countrymen have played in the NHL since 1958. He would like to be the 90th. I would say that uh, my city is more about uh, hockey because all these big names come from that city and actually they live in the, at the same street uh, all together. So that's my goal for uh, the future. I would love to live me, with my great friends that I cannot see every day. To use a baseball term, when you pitch a shutout and you go back into the locker room, what does that feel like? It's a great feeling. I try to enjoy the present moment and I think that's uh, what every human being should, should do and uh, just develop that feeling mm -hmm. because that uh, good feeling is something that you can uh, make more often to yourself if you know how to do that. Shut up! No! His focus on saves and shutouts is remarkable, but he says it's simple and it starts with hard work every day. I think it's all about the practice. Uh, with the goalie coach Rob Couture, we work every day on the details and uh, currently it's all about the details. I think that uh, what we do in the practices, that's that massive memory and then uh, in the game, it's just about the instincts. I would say obviously uh, you have to be mentally tough and go over the mental stuff too in your head and practice that things too. I think that uh, mm -hmm. that might be even more important than the, uh, the physical stuff. Well, hopefully that advantage works out. Thank you so much for spending the time with us with the goalie, Bill Steckis, Fox 42 Sports.